TMCX would be launching futures contracts on the ICOMDEX Energy Index on October 7th, which is tomorrow. But what is this index? What are its constituents? What are the contract specifications? What are the advantages of trading this index, etc. These are some of the questions that we will talk about in this brief introductory video on the energy index. So let us get started right away. Just like the bullion index and the base metals index that were launched last year by the MCX, the MCX ICOMDEX energy index is an excess return index as it measures not only price returns but also rollover yield returns. The index comprises of the near month futures contracts of the two energy commodities that are traded on the MCX, crude oil futures and natural gas futures. The ICOMDEX energy index is a weighted average index of its individual constituents. It was introduced last year but historical data for the index is available from 31st December 2015 onwards when the index was assigned a base value of 10,000. Speaking of individual constituents, crude oil constitutes 75% of the index weight while natural gas constitutes the remaining 25%. Keep in mind that these weights are not permanent. Instead, the index is rebalanced at the start of the January roll period. The exchange announces the new weight three months in advance, that is in October. You may now wonder how are the individual weights determined? Well, the individual weights are determined based on two parameters, liquidity and economic importance of the commodity. As you can see in the pie chart, 75% of the weight is calculated based on liquidity of individual commodities traded on the MCX over the past 12 months. The balance 25% of the weight is calculated based on physical market size in India. This consists of the production and import statistics over the past five financial years. So as you can see, liquidity has a significant say in determining the weight of each commodity within the index. Let us now briefly talk about how the value of the futures contract is delivered. The futures contract of the energy index is derived from the value of the spot energy index. In other words, the underlying of the ICOMDEX energy index futures contract is the ICOMDEX energy index spot contract. The ICOMDEX energy index futures is nothing but the ICOMDEX energy index spot plus the cost of carry. Meanwhile, the ICOMDEX energy index spot is a weighted average index that is calculated based on the individual crude oil index and natural gas index contracts. Each of these individual indices are calculated from the respective near month commodity futures contracts. That is, the ICOMDEX crude oil index is calculated from the near month crude oil futures contract while the ICOMDEX natural gas index is calculated from the near month natural gas futures contract. What about the calculation part? Well, the ICOMDEX energy index is calculated in a similar manner in which the ICOMDEX bullion index and the ICOMDEX base metals index are computed. If you are interested in learning how the energy index derives its value on normal days as well as on rollover days, we suggest you watch the video that we did on the MCX ICOMDEX base metals index wherein we spoke extensively about the index computation part. The link for that video has been shared in the description of this video. The rollover and expiry of the energy index futures contract is based on the near month crude oil futures contract. The rollover of the energy index lasts two trading days before the start of the pre-expiry margin period of crude oil futures contract. Meanwhile, the energy index expires one trading day before the start of the rollover period. Let us understand this using an example of November 2021 crude oil futures. The November crude oil futures contract expires on the 18th of next month. The pre-margin period of crude oil futures lasts five trading days up to the expiry period. In other words, the pre-margin period lasts from 12th to 18th of November. The region highlighted in yellow illustrates this. Note that 13th and 14th have been excluded because they fall on a weekend. 
The rollover period of the November Energy Index futures lasts two trading days prior to the start of the pre-margin period of crude oil futures. In other words, the rollover for the November Energy Index futures contract lasts from 10th to 11th of November. Finally, the expiry of the November Energy Index futures contract is one trading session before the start of the two-day rollover period. This happens to be 9th of November. In essence, in any month, the Energy Index Futures contract expires 8 trading sessions before the expiry of the Crude Oil Futures contract. Here are some contract specifications of the ICOMDEX Energy Index Futures contract. The lot size is 125. At the current index value of around 6000, the total contract value is approximately 7.5 lakhs. The tick size is 1 rupee, meaning a 1 point move in the index would lead to a profit or loss of 125 rupees. The ICOMDEX Energy Index is a monthly contract and at any point in time, three contracts would be available for trading. Near month, next month and far month. The margin required to trade the futures contract would be minimum of 10% or SPAN plus ELM, whichever is higher. Meanwhile, the contract would be settled in cash. If you want to read the entire contract specification, please click on the link that is shared in the description of this video. Let us now talk about some of the benefits of trading the ICOMDEX Energy Index. Compared to individual crude oil and natural gas futures contracts, the energy index is less volatile as it consists of two commodities instead of just one. As a result, the risk gets diversified. The index will offer some cushion in case there is an adverse move in one commodity. The total contract value of a combined position in crude oil futures and natural gas futures is around 11 lakhs. However, in case of energy futures, it is around 7.5 lakhs. Hence, Energy futures will have a lower margin requirement than taking a combined position in both crude oil futures and natural gas futures. If you have an underlying exposure in crude oil futures and or natural gas futures, you could hedge your position by taking an offsetting position in energy index futures. That is, energy index futures can be used to hedge exposure in individual commodities. Energy index futures shares a low correlation with the stock markets. Also, during the late expansionary stage when inflation becomes a threat, there is a tendency for energy commodities to outperform stocks. Hence, the ICOMDEX Energy Index futures can be used to diversify one's investment portfolio. This chart shows the historical performance of the ICOMDEX Energy Index, Crude Oil Index and Natural Gas Index. Given how heavily weighted crude oil is in the index, goes without saying, movements in crude oil has a strong influence on the index. These are some statistics of the energy index spot contract. While the index has struggled from a long term perspective, see that it has given strong returns over the medium term thanks to a multi month rally in the price of crude oil and natural gas. We are happy to inform that the MCX ICOMDEX Energy Index futures would be available for trading on FIRE's platform from 7th October onwards. If you have any question regarding the index, feel free to ask in the comment section below. Alternatively, you could also ask a question on FIRE's community. If you found this video useful, do not forget to click on the like button. We wish you happy trading.